uh, flaming cock tavern. Hey, I love it. <laughs> I love it. Is this the flaming cock? The tavern attached is, yeah. <laughs> I like the name. <laughs> yes, I will like a room here at the flaming cock. <laughs> well, the end is not. Okay, fine. <laughs> oh, no. We're not the flaming cock in. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> That's wow. what you were worried about. Yeah. yeah. The water so, closet. Okay. The water closet. Uh, you get back there, yeah. and, and yeah, there's a. Who do you help? What? Do you need help? Doing what? Washing your back or whatever. Not by you, no. Oh, right. <laughs> hey, do you got people who are. Here's um, nobody in my. <laughs> I haven't even left my room yet. He's like yelling at me through the wall. Nice. Anybody need help walking their backs? In case I walk by, see him book naked yelling in a wall, and I just open my book and walk it. Um, you get to the, yeah, you go to the uh, bathhouse, and there's a very attractive female attendant. Everyone down there take a bath. Were you hitting on her pretty hard? Oh, yeah. God, where's my dice? Well, Luke, nice. You're not no. You're throwing <laughs> out so bad. It's like you're all the one on on this, learning. It's my penis. <laughs> you ever seen any sex? <laughs> <laughs> Once you go draw, you you'll never know. <laughs> Once you go draw, you'll be so unhappy. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Anyway. All right. So. <laughs> Next yeah. time, baby. <laughs> I could knit you some nipple tassels. We're all sitting together, yeah. right? Hmm? Hear that? I'll yell it to more talk at the other table. More talk! <laughs> can we hear the conversation? <laughs> yeah, it's not hard. <clears throat> uh, can we roll about yes. Stonebreak Mountain? If you hear him say Stonebreak Mountain, you can do a, a intelligence geography check if you like. I know. Stonebreak Mountain is a rumored area that was populated by dwarves at one point. Okay. It's right. not far from here. I'm more talk. I'm with her. So. Oh, like with and, and us. her? I'd like to, but... <laughs> What's your mind? Get some for me! I don't know. What's your charisma? Uh, 14, so... Uh, <laughs> yeah. Even country's like, no, no. <laughs> so, we have some missing information, eh? Hmm. <sighs> Somebody hit him with something. <laughs> uh, well, what about 200 for us to go there and to investigate the situation? But uh, if we're able to return with, um, let's say, uh, some evidence that we've actually taken care of this, then perhaps you double the price? I would triple the price with that. Oh, yeah, yeah then. Uh, you're good at this. All right. We can make the <laughs> 400 and the way. I don't know. What's the charisma of the mayor? <laughs> oh. <laughs> 17. That, I wouldn't blame you. His wife's a, a 20, so. Oh, yeah, that's all you. I don't know what I'm saying. How old is the wife? Um, Tell me your wife and your I, children. I'm not How sure much? I can <laughs> swing that way, but I could be persuaded. I need more in my shop. <laughs> uh, maybe we can get a swing thing going between the four. Yeah, double. Yeah. Torture. Yeah, well, yeah. it's full of but... <laughs> <laughs> A little, little, yeah, little, yeah. little oil, maybe Ooh. a bat. That's all right. Find the cobalt. <laughs> Find the cobalt. Find the cobalt. <laughs> oh, there he is. Martin. <laughs> if I walk in and you're in like leather gear and Marv's hiding in a barrel. <laughs> And, then, and you're holding a pineapple and some grease. <laughs> right. I'm leaving. We're done. I'm game over. Like, I'm kind of getting back in the mode of Mortok. He's not that bad. No, he's but he's that bad. He's no, he is that bad. He is that bad. Did you get into Pigeon View? And it's very much just a settlement. There's not even. There's only like maybe two structured buildings in the whole thing. Oh, okay. They came. The way he explains it is. They came in the night and they were dark and and sinister, giggled a lot, and basically ate people as they went through. Like with salt and pepper or just raw? Raw. <clears throat> yeah, I got natural twenty plus two charisma, right? You add your your Yeah, this place did get attacked. Oh, okay. Um You're talking to an elder basically who's at the campfire. 
He says uh, that it, it was uh, goblinoids, goblins mostly. They just came out of over the hill and droves. Thankfully, uh, my friend is a wizard, so he was able to put a protection bubble up. So, making your way up the staircase is going to take roughly about an hour. Wow. It goes up into the mountain. Does anybody have goblinoid? Or yeah. goblin or orc or I have orc. orc? I think, Mike, you have goblinoid, don't you? Is a language? I thought I did, but I have Cyclops here, so I don't know. <laughs> I mean, Cyclops, are you going to be? <laughs> I don't know why it's that. It was the eight, then. Okay. Uh, you're able to... So the, the way the trap is set up is it's basically... It's wired into the lock, right? All right. So you have to pick the lock, but you have to skip a certain tumbler. Because if you don't, it sets off a pit trap. It looks like it's connected to a pit trap mechanism. All right, everybody stand back. And the pit trap is right where everybody else is standing. Yeah, yeah. exactly. You know what a horde of goblins sounds like because of the underground? This sounds bigger. This sounds like several hordes of goblins. Let's see. Shove a key to his I know what it's coming. I found the escape door. Real quick, Mortok puts together a skeleton with like the candy gram hat. <laughs> 20 or above, mm -hmm. you hear music? It sounds like a violin playing. It's, <laughs> really, <laughs> it's, a, it's a real Young Frankenstein. It's a real. <laughs> it's a really sad. Song and then we've mm -hmm. yes, very strange. You're an elf, right? Full elf, yes. Okay, you know this song. This is an elven funeral it's song by the Thompson twins. <laughs> <laughs> is this a tennis? So, as you walk around the corner, what comes to your view as you're looking at this gated door is there is a creature sitting in the room behind it on a throne okay it's a skeletal figure bright green eyes playing a violin it's wearing some really like interesting looking clothing like it's probably ancient uh royalty type i'm gonna, I'm gonna go in the corner in peace <laughs> <laughs> i'm gonna do it on my own do i have any idea what kind of creature this may be dungeoneering would tell you make a dungeoneering check if you've encountered it before, you will know. Road to 20, so, so 29 on Dungeoneering. Uh, you know this is a lich. 